Alrighty, look at this. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live in the Rialto Theater in beautiful Tucson, Arizona. Are you ready for the main And now, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He holds an MMA record. Three wins, two losses. He stands six feet, five inches tall, weighing in at 258.2 pounds. Fighting out of Santan Valley, Arizona, by way of Munich, Germany. Representing Power MMA, here is Chris the And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. He holds an MMA record, two wins, no losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 240.1 pounds. Fighting out of Tucson, Arizona, representing Rise Combat Sports, here is Samson Paul Kinghorn. And once again, ladies and gentlemen, this fight is for the Rise of the Prospects Heavyweight Championship. And when the action begins, refereeing this bout will be Raul Porata. And this fight is brought to you by the Prime Leaf. Raul Porata, our referee. The Prime Leaf, our main event. Chris Bouton and Samson Polkinghorn. Heavyweight title on the line. All right, these guys are going to get right to action. Oh! Button has him in trouble. Poking Horn is in trouble. Huge shots. Huge shots. Poking Horn on the, on the fence. Wow. What a start to this heavyweight contest right here. Samson looked like he's gathered himself. Oh, punch over the top. Oh, but Putan just throws him oh, out. Front kick, front to, the kick face. to the face. Bhutan really looking to use his reach right here. For the first time, we're seeing Samson Polkinghorn have to utilize his wrestling. Bhutan taking full advantage of his reach that he has in this fight. Wow. What a crazy start to this championship bout. Wow. This fight's not going the distance at that pace. Not with this power. I don't think so. Separation, big shots from both sides. I'd like to see Samson keep his hands up a little bit better. I'd like to, oh, punch over the top by Putan. Putan is just kind of sitting over the top, sniping. Oh, 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 K.O. Whoa. In the first round. First round knockout. Holy crap. Wow. Wow. And Samson Pokemon. Unbelievable. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. He got me when I got that motherfucker. That was Samson Pokinghorn. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, look at this. Look at this celebration. Unbelievable knockout. Unbelievable power. Wow. This is the guy you want on your show. This is the guy you want on your show. Samson Pokinghorn with a first Way to close it out. knockout. Wow.
Wow. You got to get in there and talk to that guy. I do. You got to get in there and talk to that guy. Wow. Thank you, Prime Leaf. Thank you, Prime Leaf, for sponsoring our show tonight. Thank you so much. A hell of a main event, a hell of a card. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Raul Parada calls a stop to this contest at 1 minute 27 seconds of the very first round. Declaring your winner by knockout and fighting out of the red corner and your new Rise of the Prospects heavyweight champion, Samson Polkinghorne. All right, ladies and gentlemen, are you not entertained? I hope that's okay, champ. Now listen, that was a wild fight. You got dropped there in the opening seconds of the, of the fight, I should say, and uh, it didn't matter because you put him away in emphatic fashion. How are you feeling? Go ahead. I feel uh, pretty damn good. <laughs> Obviously, my brain's not working completely correctly, but uh, no, I'm feeling good. Chris is a big dude. Chris is a huge dude. When you stand across from the cage of that dude, holy crap, he's a monster. Looking at pictures, right, I feel like a tiny guy out there, dude. So props to Chris. Let's give props to Chris. Great, great job. All right, champ. That's champ, poking horn. I want to know, and everybody wants to know, what's next and how soon. We'll see what happens. Um, you know, really, I just listen to Chris. Um, I have no, I turned 40 last Saturday, so I wanted to prove that I could fight at 40 years old. What's 40? So we'll see what happens at 40, 41, 42, 43. Um, at least I can still count. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens. I got no, you know, there, this, this was the night. If I died in here, I died in here. So I told my wife, like, I, as far as what I'm eating for my next meal, what we're doing tomorrow, I don't know if tomorrow's gonna come. So it is what it is. Uh, let me get through tonight, and then we'll figure out, you know, if I make it home. So it is what it is. So we'll see what happens in the future. All right, and anybody you wanna thank? Chris, I wanna thank Chris, Sam, Dave, every person that I sparred with at Rise. They could have been the smallest, most inexperienced person, and I still ask for feedback. Humility, I think, is key, right? You are never, you have never made it. No matter how high you are, you have never made it. So anybody I sparred with, trained with, the rise, bodybuilding, like I came from a bodybuilding background, that's all on you. Training for this, you have to have training partners. You have to have a coach, multiple coaches, and even every person you train with, every person you spar with. Again, I ask for feedback from everybody I spar with. So I want to appreciate or thank everybody from, uh, from Rise. Um, my wife, obviously, she's put up with me. I show up on Tuesday after sparring, blood everywhere. She's like, are you okay? Eh, it's, a Tuesday, it's another Tuesday night. Um, but uh, yeah, that, that's really um, the, two, the two groups of people, my, uh, Rise, everyone there, um, and, uh, and uh, my wife uh, is really who all I wanted to thank. I'm sorry I'm not speaking that clearly right now. I'm still running off a little fucking high. All right. Well, every time you come into the cage, it's an absolute fun time. And I can't wait to see what's next for you, sir. But I can guarantee I better see all of you guys at the after party over at the box yard tonight celebrating with the champ. Absolutely. I want to say one last thing. Thanks, guys, for everybody coming out. 
every single person that came out and, and, and stayed. I know it's been a long night. Um, and I also want to thank everyone behind the scenes. I want to thank the commission, and I want to thank everybody behind the scenes, the medical team, uh, Savannah, everyone who did all the, the, the graphics, the guys who set up the cage. It's a huge production to put this on. Um, and I don't want to take any more of their time because they got to break this down. They're not going to get home till way late. So, again, everybody behind the scenes, this could not happen without you guys. So really, really appreciate it. The photographers, everybody, okay? Let's give them a round of applause to finish the night out. Your champ, Samson Pokinghorn. <laughs>